previously on Pokemon Platinum Nuzlocke. Wookie was very widely making his way to the third gym leader, preparing his Pokemon for the fight that was up ahead, only to reach the next town and realize that the next gym leader was not the fighting type that he had been preparing for the entire time, but a ghost type gym leader. Now, can his team that was 100% not ready for this fight take victory when it seems the most unlikely? Or will it be the same situation as last time and he will just lose half his team to one gym leader? Find out in today's episode. Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Walking. I'm back with another Pokemon Nuzlocke episode today. Well, it turns out our next gym leader is not the one I thought it was. Yeah, for some reason in Platinum, uh, the, you're suppo even though it goes clearly first gym, second gym, third gym uh, is a fighting gym, in Platinum it's actually the ghost gym which is next that you're supposed to do, and the fighting gym is much higher level than the current gym that we're on. One moment, because someone just came home. So yeah, the plan is now to be we're fighting a ghost gym instead of the normal gym. So I, this is the team we're walking in with. We got Raiders fan, Gibble, Solrock, Dom, Big Oof, and Spoot Spoot. In case things go bad, Spoot Spoot does have normal type, which would make them immune to <laughs> ghost if they get hit by something. Let's hope it doesn't happen. But for right now, I need to train up Raiders fan. Um, and we'll be doing that by going through this gym. So, this is gonna be a tough one. I was not prepared for this one. Uh, so let's get into it, let's go. This is also what I can consider the Suicide Squad. It would be very unfortunate if I lost all these Pokemon for various reasons. So let's hope it doesn't happen. <laughs> let's go. Oh wait, no, not there. I actually wanna fight as many of these dudes as possible, so. Ooh, spooky layout though. Fitting for the ghost theme. Alright, let's see. Last scene I feel like the music is just a little bit too loud. <laughs> so I'm gonna turn down just a little bit. Okay, let's see. Well, we're almost on the same level, which is good. So I'm gonna use Bite. Alright, super effective, not bad. Now, here's the thing, Raiders Fan definitely has the speed, so I just need to be higher level and speedier than everyone else, and Raiders Fan should be able to take care of the entire gym by himself. But also, he needs a lot more levels, um, so I've given him EXP share. So let's go here. Okay, I'll beat you, sir. Easily. Gasly. That Ghastly is not looking correctly if you look at his eyes. It looks like he's cross-eyed at the moment. Which is not what you want. Nice. If you could evolve into Crobat, uh, Raider Span, that'd be very helpful. <laughs> if you want to be a buddy and evolve for me, that'd be fantastic. It would really put my mind at ease if you were in your final form. Uh-oh. Okay, let's just stop by. Bite! What? Oh, okay, Aftermath. That's a good thing to remember with Drifloon. Jesus, that did a lot of damage. It did more damage than any other thing in here. I also forgot to go to the market, so we're going to the market real quick. Oh, I need more than that. Thank you. It's Manidotes. That would be grand. Just in case. And an awakening. How, why not? Just in case. We don't need both balls right now. Hello! Eek, that's so bright. Surprise attack. Imagine being a tri- You're a little girl. Why? Ah, uh, trifling again. Damn it. I really don't like fighting these things with Aftermath. Uh-oh. Oh, thank god. 
Oh god, I was so afraid that Payback was about to just completely ruin my life. Thankfully it didn't. But yeah, imagine being a tiny child and saying, here's your first gym, you're gonna be a part of the gym now, and your gym leader just takes you out into the dark and says, here's a flashlight, find any trainers, fight them. Like, that's insane. Again, these things having payback is a real pain in the ass. But hopefully it shouldn't be too bad. Bite and chomp. One big chomp. I like how Raiders fan <laughs> the one consistency he's had for the entire run is that he flinches everyone. <laughs> I like it. I like that gimmick. It really makes fighting way easier. Thank you. 420, blaze it. Are you enjoying yourself? I mean, is anyone? Why is with all these school children in this damn haunted gym? Level 23. Okay, now we're getting into some of the meteor pros. What? Okay. Wasn't expecting that. It did save as ghastly, but it doesn't really matter. Sucker Bunch. Wanting him to evolve. I believe that is a circle. It's a moon. I was half right. Get out of the way. You're gonna really be a dick about this? Piece of shit. Oh, I see how the fuck it is. XP. I need more. We need more. Raiders fan needs to be as strong as possible if he's gonna basically solo this entire gym by himself. Okay, wasn't expecting a haunter. But let's see how this does. Damn, Raiders fan is really damn good. I don't know if you know this about my dude, but Raiders fan ain't nothing to fuck with. After he got some defense, nothing has been able to stand in his way since. Nice. More haunters. Please, because they give me a lot of EXP and I love getting EXP. That's not good. I hate getting confused though. Could you not? That's annoying. Come on, Raiders fan. Oh god, that deals damage always based on the number, doesn't it? So, he just is always is going to keep doing 23 damage to me no matter what if he keeps using Nightshade. Why did you get confused? It was the one thing I needed you not to get. Okay, come on. Snap out of it. Thank you. Good, pretty good. Mischievous. Huh, okay. That 
That's not good. It didn't do a lot of damage, but also I don't want you in the field anymore. So time for Gibble to do something. Why does Mistrevious know a psychic move? Thank god. Doesn't do shit against me though. Gibble all powerful. Gibble here to take it all to the bank. Apparently Gibble not that strong. How about Gibble make you fall asleep? Then tag back in Raiders fan to kill you. How about... Oh, why are you being such a bitch right now, Mischievous? Fantina's totally gonna have a Mischievous, isn't it? Isn't she? Thank you! should do, because now I'm afraid of being side in the face. I do have an X defend, so what if I just use the X defend um, during the fight? But er, during, like, one of her- <gasps> Hold the fucking phone. My boy! Congratulations, your Raiders fan evolved into a Crobat. <laughs> Good job, buddy. Good job. Okay. Time to get fucking serious next time. Okay. Let's do this. Oh, ho, ho, ho. That's right. I have him to beat you down. Stay magnifique. All right. So I'm gonna do the thing I was talking about, which was right at the start, depending on which Pokemon she picks. Let's see who it is. Okay, it's a Duskull, so I can just use X Defense. I'm just being super cautious here with Raiders Fan. I think he can go all the way for us, but he needs all the help I can give him. Because he's basically gonna have to do this solo. Future Sight? Okay. I foresee an ass whooping in your future. I was half right. Ooh. Good job dodging the will of the whiff. That would have been very bad. I've also removed EXP share and given him a chesto berry. It's a damn shame we don't have anything that deals with um, confusion. I wish I did. Oh god. That's literally the worst thing possible. I'm gonna try using a Confuse Ray. I know I'm faster than it. So I'm gonna assume it's gonna try and do the same tactic to me, which is get hit me with a Confuse Ray or Side Beam. Let's see which one happens first. Okay, good. Good, go, Raiders fan. Hit him. Hit him hard. Hit him deep. Deep in the paint. Balls deep. This is more, more like a mismatchious. He's gonna get completely crit! Oh, damn it, it survived. Come on, die, 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 die. Shit. Not bad, okay. So now we know she doesn't stand a chance against us at all. This is your ace Pokemon, isn't it? After the ass woman we got last gym, I did not want to repeat of what happened last time. So our boy Raiders fan went from potentially dying at every single given turn to the comeback of the century. This is my final Pokemon, damn right. Out of my face. Bit. I should have healed. Didn't matter, you got flinched! 
out of my face! The Flinch Master! Flinch Supreme! Good job, Raiders fan. You deserve it. Damn right you lost because of Raiders fan here. Oh god. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I graciously accept. But yeah, that's that's the end of today's episode, everyone. I mean, next episode we'll continue forward. I really didn't expect to be fighting this one. Oh wait, there is one thing I have to do before we go. Hello. I believe this is the person that will give me. Baby, hello, baby. It's like, oh shit, no, yes. God damn it. Yes. This is, of course, none other than Wong, who was the EV in our last game. Shout out to Wong. I wonder what level this EV is. 20? Not bad. That's the end of today's episode, everyone. Thank you very much for joining me for what was basically the coming out party to Raiders fan completely dominating as a crowbat. Um, once again, uh, thank you very much for watching. If you want to show some form of support, you can always leave a like. It is greatly appreciated. It does help out the channel a whole bunch. Um, and it also just makes me happy, you know? I put a lot of effort into this stuff to remember it. It would be nice to get some likes in response, but. That's the end of today's video, everyone. You guys have a good day, and I'll see you guys in the next Nuzlocke adventure. Peace out.